What's up everybody on YouTube? Today we're gonna to do part two of my favorite stuff that's selling on Morph Market right now. We got some puzzle stuff. We even have a gene that's called Mosaic. I don't think I've ever heard of that before today. Uh, we have some Ultramel ones and Monarch ones, some other good stuff. So I think you'll like this video. All right, let's get started. This one's a banana pinstripe puzzle. And uh, banana, I think you can get about 225 bucks for uh, a hatchling, so that's pretty good. And puzzle is really popular right now. It's kind of expensive. This is a male, it was produced last year. This one is $3,000. This one is a leopard, 100% het monarch, 100% het clown. Monarch's starting to make its way onto the scene. It's a really popular recessive. Uh, it's got its own color palette to it that doesn't compare to any other snakes. It's a really cool looking snake. This one's a male. It was produced last year. It is $3,000. This one is a razor black pastel. I don't know if I've seen razor before, maybe one other time, but uh, relatively new gene. This is a male produced in 2018. He's 1,400 grams, so he's definitely ready to go. It doesn't say he's a proven breeder, though. Uh, this one is $2,750. This one is a mahogany cinnamon, 100% het clown mystic. And mahogany and cinnamon are pretty popular codons right now. This one is a male produced this year. It's 153 grams. Looks okay. Uh, it's $2,500. Uh, but when you breed it to a visual clown, it'll look a lot better, I think. This one is a mosaic, 100% het clown. I haven't seen much mosaic, maybe one other time. So it's a relatively new gene. Um, this snake doesn't look that like much but it still looks kind of cool um, I think it has some potential and you breed it to a visual clown it'll look probably a lot better uh, this is a female produced last year it's 270 grams so it's still got a ways to go before you can breed her uh, this one's $2,500 this one is a bamboo 100% het sunset if you're wanting to get in the sunset game at least get you a het to get started this is a male uh, he's a proven breeder, uh, produced in 2019. He's 725 grams, so he's ready to go. If you get yourself a visual sunset or a head, if you want to play the odds game. Um, yeah, this is a male. He's ready to go, $2,500. All right, this one is a Pastel Enchi Mandarin Fire Mon uh, Bongo. Uh, Bongo and Mandarin are really popular right now, so I think this is a great snake. Uh, this is a male produced last year. He's 120 grams, so he's got a ways to go before he's ready to go. He is $4,500. This one is a leopard, 100% het ghost redhead. And redhead leopard uh, are really popular right now. And uh, ghost has always been a, a good recessive to go with. Uh, a lot of people like it. Uh, this is a male produced last year, 166 grams, $4,500. This one is a, another triple het. It is 100% het VPI Exantic, 100% het Desert Ghost, 100% het Pied. It's got Orange Dream in them. Uh, this is a female produced last year, 380 grams, uh, $4,500. So many different directions you can go with this, and everyone loves Orange Dream. This one is a Yellow Belly Pastel GHI Confusion. She's a female produced last year, 98 grams, so she's got a ways to go before she's ready to be bred. But... Uh, if you're wanting to get into the Confusion Project, it is really popular right now. And GHI, everyone loves GHI. Yellow Belly is really popular too. This one's $4,000. All right, this one is a Super Coral Glow Mandarin Yellow Belly. Uh, if you want to have all your babies be Coral Glow, this is a snake for you. Uh, coral Glows, you can get about $225 for a hatchling just for a single gene morph. That's pretty expensive. So, uh, and Mandarin is a very popular gene. Comes with a pretty big pi price tag. This is a female produced last year, 150 grams, $4,000. Can do a lot of damage with that snake. All right, this one's a Spectre GHI 100% Het Clown Lesser. Looks pretty cool. Um, like I said, GHI is pretty popular. Spectre is starting to get really popular, and Clown always has been popular. This is a male produced last year. It's $4,000. This one is a 100% Het Cryptic, 100% Het Clown. Ultramel, so it's a visual Ultramel, looks great. Love the colors, orange on it. Uh, it's 66% Het Pied. It's a male produced last year, $4,000. So potentially you can make four different uh, recessives, so pretty cool. 
This one is a Blackhead Enchi Clown. Blackhead's really popular right now. Uh, it's a male, produced last year, 230 grams. She's got a ways to go before you can breed them. $9,000, isn't that crazy? I don't know why it's so expensive. I mean, Clown comes with a price tag, but I guess Blackhead does too. All right, this one is a Genetic Stripe, 100% Het Cryptic, 100% Het Desert Ghost, Clown, Red Stripe, Black Pastel. All of these genes are really popular right now. Uh, this snake looks incredible. This is a female produced this year, $7,000. That'll tell you a lot about that snake. All right, this is a super sable clown. Uh, so all the babies would be sables. And sable is kind of a slept on gene. I think it's relatively new. But man, this snake looks incredible. This is a male produced last year, 164 grams. It's $6,000. This one is a mahogany pastel hidden gene woma clown female produced last year, 220 grams. Doesn't look like much. But Hidden Gene Woma is starting to make its way back onto the scene, and Mahogany is really popular, and you can't go wrong with Clown. Female, 200, it's uh, 220 grams, produced last year, $6,000. All right, this is a Wookie Clown. Wookie cl is a really popular gene right now, and uh, if, you do a, if you produce Wookie Clowns, you get a really hefty price tag. It's $5,500. This is a male produced this year. It's 140 grams. All right, this one is a import. Um, so maybe you might actually get some other type of gene in here that you didn't know about or it could spontaneously morph into something else but of course that could happen with any ball python uh, so you kind of get a little bit more for your bang for your buck if you go with an import because you might get something else in there that you didn't know that was there this is a male uh, it's produced in 2018 I don't know how they know that if it's an import but it's 1200 grams it's a proven breeder uh, so this guy's ready to go. $5,500. Monarch is a recessive gene. It's really popular. All right, here's another Monarch. This is a super pastel Monarch. It's a male produced in 2019. It's 1,300 grams, so it's ready to go. It also is a proven breeder, so all the babies would be pastel. This one is $4,500. I right, got another Monarch. This one's a super pastel Monarch. It's got Mojave in it. It's a lot crisper because part of the reason is because it's a baby. Um, I think it looks a lot better than that last one, but uh, this is a female produced this year. It's only 89 grams, so it's got a long ways to go. It's 5,500 bucks. This one's an Enchi 100% Het Clown Hurricane. It's uh, a male produced in 2018. It's 1,100 grams. It is a proven breeder. I don't know why, I've showed this in other videos. I don't know why someone hasn't bought this one yet. Uh, to get some Hurricane Clowns, those are really popular. Definitely come with a big price tag though. This one's 5,500 bucks. All right, this one's a Mahogany Hidden Gene Woma Clown. Male produced last year, 235 grams. Doesn't look like much, but it's got three really popular genes right now. $5,500. This one is a Cinnamon Hidden Gene Woma, Odium, Yellow Belly, Lucifer. All of these genes are popular right now. It's a great snake. It's a male produced in 2018. Hasn't been bred yet. $5,000. This one is a pastel cinnamon sandblast. 100% het clown. 66% het pied. It's a female. It's 150 grams. Uh, sandblast you can make uh, camos with. I'm for, I forgot what else you have to uh, breed sandblast with in order to get the camos. Urban camos. Uh, but cinnamon's popular, can't go wrong with clown or pied, so it's a pretty good snake. Female, it's 150 grams. Doesn't say when it was produced, but it is a hatchling. Uh, it's $5,000. All right, that concludes our video. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit the like button, and we'll see you tomorrow.